Hello once again ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to NRK Plays The Forest. Um, since last we met, uh, my save got corrupted. Uh, this time not at the fault of the game. Uh, I'm not sure what happened, but whenever I loaded my save I'd, got an, I'd get an epileptic fit out of the game. So I'm not really sure what hell happened there. I'd like to dedicate this uh, video to Arthur Korzenuski. I'm sorry if I pronounced your last name wrong. But, uh, yes. So, Arthur's been a lovely commenter for a lot of videos, actually. And, yes, he deserves a mention. So, hats off to you, sir. Um, as you can see here, I've built kind of a better looking base than the last one. I've got a stick holder and a log holder now, and a little rabbit's cage. I actually have no idea how to put rabbits in there, as there's no real option for picking up rabbits. It's just kind of just kind of kill them. So, I can't... I, I, I don't know what to do. Um, I'm not really sure what kind... I think it's... Okay, it's almost day. So before it was kind of pitch black dark and there was no moon, so I couldn't tell what time of day it was. So I'll just give you a little tour of my uh, base of operations at the moment. i got little little seating places here. Not built yet. There are only, only a couple of logs, so... Little seats around the fire, some some farms which are probably going to be very useful, and I'm starting to build a border. I've already created a trap, so yes. And Miguel is playing Counter Strike Global Offensive, so there's something to look out for as well. All right. So there's a couple of cannibals out in the border. Should probably turn off Steam Chat though. Just so I don't get any more pop-ups or interruptions. So I need to cut down more trees. As you can see down the bottom left-hand corner, I need 20 logs. Um, I've got four in my log holder. I think logs can only, uh, log holders can only hold up to eight logs, which isn't much. But then again, that is f quite a bit considering I can only hold two. So this is my method of cutting down trees as it gives you the ability to cut all the way around the tree and to also see everything around you. I need you. Oh boy. I'm really starting to get annoyed with the, the way that some of the logs just flick up and fly around. Alright, so we've got one farm. My hands are a little bit dirty. I'm going to need to wash them off. Alright, we have two farms. It's also pissing down rain, so I might need to um, reignite my fire soon. Okay. So I got a little bit of fire, but it is really running down, so it's not a good thing. So I'm not sure if that'll attract cannibals, but it's it's kind of in the middle of the day, so I don't think it's going to be too much of a problem. I did see a couple of them, but um, I think they've headed off now. I've had a couple of um, weird experiences in this game since we last met. Um, I had... See this lovely tree here? The tree that I cannot cut down. I had a lovely cannibal sitting on that tree. She, was, she wasn't really sitting, she was kind of just hanging there on the tree. I think she was waiting for me. And um, yeah, it, it kind of glitched out a bit and she was off the tree. She was about, I don't know, a couple of meters in between um, the tree. I could just cut down the, that big tree there. So I don't really know what happened there. A little bit of a glitch, but I, I mean, it's okay. <laughs> Glitches are to be expected. Alright, I'm out of the logs out of my log holder, so I'm gonna have to cut down some more trees. So yeah, she was she was kind of just in between those two trees there. She was just hanging. And I didn't know if it was like a a new effigy or it was a glitch, so evidently it was a glitch. Cause it was the middle of the night and I could barely see anything, so it... What is that? What did I just do? 
I thought it was a rag. Alright, I gotta find some water. Covered in blood, wash to avoid infection. Okay, so I assume putting my hands in water would have worked, but apparently not. Right, let's try and... There's a funky tree. It's a big tree. Alright, so we've reached a beach again. And we all know how good I am at finding beaches. Apparently in one of the new updates, sharks were at it, so I need to be a bit weary. Alright, so... I dare say I'm washed now. Alright, I'm all clean. I don't know how... Running in around the in the rain hasn't cleaned my arms, but... Swimming in the ocean has. Alright, so we shall return home to a camp that hopefully hasn't been overrun. Oh, I thought I was a lot f further away from the plane than that. So, evidently I'm very close to the plane. Eat some food, because I'm hungry. Alright. <laughs> Okie doke. So I have a little trap here. It's not going to do much at the moment, but um, it's good to have a trap. It's very bright. I'm used to storms being in the dark. Okay. Oops, didn't mean to do that. Alrighty. Alright, so I'm going to need to actually get my axe out again. Um, this fire does not want to stay lit. And I'm going to need some logs for my lovely defense of just two walls at the moment. Oh, this is... No. It's like the fourth time I've done that. Damn trees not wanting to get cut and stuff. Is there any any way I can summon a rain wizard and stop it from raining? Yes, so sharks have been added, so have houseboats. Um, I do believe more effigies have been added as well. So that's cool. I'm just going to go put this straight on the wall because that means we'll have one wall up. Alright, there's one wall. Okie doke. Alright, so I need four more logs there. And then I'll have everything that I have blueprints for at the moment constructed. So yes, um, I think the stick holder is something new as well. So I grabbed one of them. So is the rabbit uh, cage. But I mean, <laughs> I really don't know how to use the rabbit cage. <laughs> Post in the comments section if you know how to use the rabbit cage and teach me. <laughs> Because I really have no idea. Cut your damn tree. I tried sneaking up behind rabbits to chat to them. Um, I don't know if you got to like somehow kill them and revive them. Okay. So yes, I haven't really seen many cannibals in this episode. Uh, so we saw a couple at the beginning. Maybe they don't like the thunder. 
completely understandable. All right, one more log. One more log after this one, and we will have our defense of two walls. Thought I saw like a first aid kit. Would be nice at a time like this. Oh, there's a log there. I'll just grab this log, won't I? Okie doke. We're moving up in the world, ladies and gentlemen. We're moving up in the world. We have a bit of a wall. Alright. So I've got some wall. Alright. So I think I will have a nap just to save the game. And then we can... Oh, I kind of wish it would still be day. So I was going to say we could go for a little bit of exploring. Alright, so let's go for a little, a little bit of exploring because you guys have seen construction videos everywhere. So let's just explore. There's not much to be seen. Oh, okay. I'm dying of hypothermia. I need to find a fire. I guess I won't be exploring. Alright, so I'm also hungry. There's no more berries on this plant. And this farm hasn't been done yet. So, hopefully we can find a small animal who is willing to give us his organs and meat. I can't see any rabbits. Oh, there's one. And there it goes. Come here, let me eat you, rabbit. He's getting away. He, he dive. He he went through the rock. That's cheating. Die, rabbit. Got him. Ah, oh, damn fire's gone out again. All right, so rain is not very good with fires. Understandable. I had a lizard the whole time. So right, we'll cook that as well. Just gonna make sure the fire keeps going. Come on, burn! All right. So it keeps asking me to open my survival book. I have already opened it. Leave me alone. Alright. So now I'm nice and full. Alright, so let's go for another sleep, I believe. And hopefully it will be daytime. Alright, it is daytime. Good. Alright, let's get the axe out. And go for a little bit of exploration. So I might go this way. past the pond. Let's see what's going on over here. Hopefully we don't run into any cannibals, but the likelihood of that is very unlikely. Ooh, this looks like a... What's that noise? What is that noise? I have a spear. Oh, medication. Alright, so I'm going to get my axe back out, even though the spear is cool. Oh, we'll use you as armor. Alright. So. The music has started playing, so that makes me kind of think something's up. No? Ooh. Bunch of luggage just turned up. Oh, wow. I think I found a big cannibal base. 
There's a dead one here. Okay. There is a lot of cannibals there. Wow. I can count at least like 10. Nope. Not today. But what do you mean, in arcade? Cannibals are so friendly. Nope. <laughs> There's a big hole here. Don't know if this has any significance. I don't believe so. It's just like a farm of stick trees. Alright, so we found where the cannibals are coming from. Okay, there's another effigy. So yes, I believe that is their base. I've been told they have a very, uh, a very big base as well, like the, like a sort of mothership base. I don't know how to explain it, but, um, yes, I've heard it's quite creepy. So, we're back at my base, and I believe I might end the video here. So if I have constructed all the utilities I need for my base, as you can see, I'll do like a little, a little pan. There we go. Little looky. Alright, so, I just need to construct a wall, I believe, and then we can all... I don't know. What will we do? Maybe invade their base. I'm not sure. Or we can look for more stuff. Post in the comment section what you think I should do. Alright. I'd like to thank you all very much for watching. If you enjoyed this video, please subscribe, favorite, comment, like, share. Join the f social media things. I don't... I, yes. And as always, ladies and gentlemen, have a fantastic day. I'll see you next time.